Hello everyone, yes, I'm back. I'm still recovering for the cold I had in the past weeks. That's why I'm not on camera today, but I have a very good voice today, so I wanted to show you what was in my mailbox recently, and we will start with the glossy box. To be honest, I've unsubscribed to glossy box after receiving the pop art edition, but unfortunately it was the end of the month, so I received the November box anyway. With my box, I have this envelope from Best Secret. It's a website with an exclusive membership by recommendation only. And, um, well, I have a £20 voucher and I will see if I can buy any fashion items with it or not. And I will let you know it in the end of the video. But first of all, let's see what's inside the glossy box of November edition in the UK. The first product, I'm not sure I will use it. It's an Argan Oil of Morocco shampoo from OGX. And let's be honest, the composition is extremely uh, synthetic with silicones and a sodium laureate sulfate derivative. So yeah, I will give it to somebody else. I am way more interested by this lip shine from Burt's Bee because it's 100% natural. It's a full size and um, it's a very nice uh, pink color called Whisper. Then we have a tiny sample of this face oasis uh, hydrating treatment from H2O Plus that is supposed to hydrate the skin as a mask. I'm very keen to try it on. Then we have this full size close your eyes go dancing long lasting eye pencil from Lollipops. It's a black color and um, well to be honest I've tried it on my hand and it doesn't seem to be that long lasting but um, that's a good idea. The only problem is I already received it in the French October Glossy Box, but um, anyway, that's a good discovery. Last but not least, I received this Refining Capri Facial Oil from Menu Skincare, and uh, I'm very glad I received this because it's for oily or spot prone skin types, well, my skin type, and um, I mean, I never heard about this product, I never heard about this kind of product, so I'm very keen to try it and to let you know if it's uh, working or not on my skin. Okay guys, so it's time for me to do the math to know if this box is a good value or not, so um, let's jump into it. Just like last month I paid full price for this box, £13. You can see here the value of every product I received. I'm very glad the one I will not use, the shampoo, is not expensive at all. In the end, the box value is more than twice the price of the box, so I'm very happy. It's very funny because at first sight I thought this box was very light because uh, the products are not very big, so um, it's good to do the math sometimes. As I told you in the beginning of the video, I've unsubscribed to Glossybox, so this was my last Glossybox um, video, for the moment at least. But uh, I'm very glad I received this one, and uh, really, I mean, I prefer Birchbox for some reasons. Uh, the eShop, the points that uh, are a good value on the eShop and everything. But anyway, I'm glad I received some uh, Glossybox to let you know about it and to make you see that it's a good option too. So I guess this is all for today. I wish you a very happy day and I will see you in my next video. Bye bye!